Good morning, friends. I figured I do. I would do a little vlog. It is Friday. What's this? April third. I don't even know. Um, I'm home. I'm officially working from home. In fact, you can see I've got my office set up right back here in the living room. So I don't have a spare room. Um, I am on lunch break right now, so I figured I would pop in. I'll show you kind of the setup over here. So <clears throat> let me flip the screen. Okay, so, well, this is a new rug, by the way. Um, it's really bright and fancy, and I got it for like 25 bucks at Wayfair, and there's Nitro saying hello. There we go. It was fuzzy. Um, I have my candles burning. Nitro's chilling out on the chair. I pulled in a little um, coral pillow that I had there, and, of course, we still have the pink out, Um and I, for my centerpiece here, I've got my candles going. You guys have seen me do some candles. Um, this is from Deco Crated, and I just filled it with some rosebuds and stuff and made a pretty, um, and I've got a little, my ocean jasper is my favorite stone right there. And I, um, I just filled it with my favorite roses. Um, that blanket came from like FabFitFun or something. And then the coral pillow was from Target. And then over here is my little workstation minus ignore my little chip bowl over here, but I have, I just have a chair from my room down here and I pulled over, um, pulled this over here and put some flowers on. It's got my paperwork and all on it because I've got to work. And then in the corner, I just have a couple pillows, the cat stuff. We have to clean some of this stuff up, but these are like old pillows that I don't, I usually put covers over them. Um, and I just put some peonies in the corner. So overall, um, this is what we're working with. Now, here I've got uh, some stuff to show you guys. This is a little sneak peek of uh, a celebration thing from Natalie Attired that came in. That is going to be a video of all this makeup I've collected over months of being home. And I need to go through and show you guys do a makeup haul. Gizzy's looking at the outside and uh, she wants to go out there. She's not afraid at all to be outside, which is a concern. Um, and then this came in. So this is from you can see right here, knock, knock. And I don't know if I have any referrals or anything, but this is a quarterly subscription. This one is for spring and they deliver flowers to your door. So you can kind of see that it is kale and pansies. It's decorative kale that comes in like a, like here, you can see it's like purple. I'll show you guys after I put it in the pots and there's two of them. Um, I want to say it was like $65 and they ship them like this. I don't want to pull it up, but anyway, they, they ship them and they give you instructions on how to plant them and they may go out there. I'm not sure if they're going to go out on our back deck yet, or they're going to go on the front porch. They're supposed to be for your front porch, but you put them wherever you want. And I just went this morning and got some, there's more information about the flowers that they sent you. And I just got some out front, some, um, turquoise pots that they're going to go in and some soil. So we are trying to obviously make the best of all of this going on. Um, I had a little bit of a panic attack the other day. Um, I just got nervous. I just started getting like worried and I just had a really bad panic attack. And, um, and then yesterday sitting in my chair, I had a different chair down here. I had such a pinched nerve in my back and I had to take all this medicine just to function yesterday and it made me sleepy and I passed out and then I couldn't fall asleep last night. <laughs> bad couple of nights and you know it was funny because I had to go to um I had to go to Lowe's this morning to get the potting soil um just so those don't die I honestly forgot I think I ordered them like four or five months ago but the winter bundle whatever they send for winter was passed and they send you it for your your location your your like planting zones and stuff so I had to go there to get soil and and I had to go get the buckets you know like the potting the pots to put the stuff in and it was so weird because Lowe's has X's um all along like where you would wait to check out that are six feet apart so each person had to like basically stand six feet apart and then they had six feet apart in each aisle they had X's and then they had um like the the cashiers and stuff had like a uh, a partition over them where it was just a spot for you to like put your credit card into the machine and stuff like that. They were wearing gloves. Um, when I walked in, they were spraying the carts down and wiping them down. They were spraying after each customer. They were wiping down, um, the, uh, keep the pad thing. 
And it's just, we live in different times right now. And it, it's just, you know, it's getting real. Our governor here in Virginia put us on lockdown till June 10th already. June 10th. So I'm going to be working from home for a while. Um, I'll be here for a while. In fact, I've got to get I've got to get back to work here in just a little bit. I'll show you my pretty potted plants as soon as I get them finished. Maybe that will brighten your day. I'm sure hoping it's going to brighten mine. Um, they're looking a little rough, so they need to get planted soon. They said they would perk up after you plant them and they were watered. So, um, And Nitrosol made himself comfortable. Look at him. <laughs> Let me see if I can show you. He's just got right up there. <laughs> and Gizzy is still looking outside. <laughs> the minute I put like a new... Um, couch cover on that couch nitro's like all over it and I sprayed it because it kind of the couch smells so bad like dog that's like the dog couch nobody's no humans sit on that couch um, but I got this it's orange and grapefruit scent and it's non-toxic for animals and it's for animals you can see it here and it's an odor and spot remover by Abby and Sullivan I got this at um at Marshall's it was three dollars and 99 cents I'm almost I think I'm almost out of it. I've got like a quarter of it left and I really like it. It smells really, really nice. Doesn't seem to bother the animals at all. I haven't used it to get spots out, but I've used it just for just freshening up the, um, the upholstery and stuff and it's worked really great. And um, so I'm gonna get more. I'm actually gonna go sit down now and get a cup of tea and relax. I've got a little bit of my lunch break left and I am going to chill for a little bit and then power through the rest of my calls and today and really work hard. And then after that, sorry. My arm's getting tired here. Um, after that, I don't know what we're going to do. It's Friday. I may I may go ahead and do that Natalie Attired um, video because it's just like four tops, like three tops and a cardigan. So I may do that, and then I want to do the makeup, the makeup haul with you guys too and show you all the fun stuff that I got in. I got a Pat McGrath palette that I've been – it's the one that like was calling my name, and it was the hardest one to get. You know, that came in, so I'll show you guys that. Today on my eyes, I just used, it's a palette I was deciding, do I get rid of or do I keep? It's the Urban Decay Born to Run. Is it creasing? Do watch it. Um, I really like the eye look that I did today on this, but um, the first eye look I did creased horribly, so I didn't, I'm not going to keep that one um, if, it, if it does it again. So we're seeing, we're testing it today with primers and stuff, and we're going to see if it works. So I'll see you guys all in a little bit, and uh, we'll probably just do a weekend vlog for now. In addition to, my cats are making noises, in addition to like our unboxings and stuff, just so I can kind of touch base with you guys. And if you're not, make sure you sign up for or join our Facebook group page. It's growing. Um, I think that's it, guys. I hope you're having a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys all in a little bit. Okay. Gizzy. Of course, she just stopped. Gizzy is making this horrible noise. She does this when somebody leaves the house. What's wrong, baby? Hold on. What's wrong? What is wrong? You can't find somebody? She gets lost or just... Don't you jump up there. I see what you're thinking. Nope. We can't go by the candles. Nope. Get down. What are you doing? Alright, I just have to show you that all of my babies, not all of them, are in here visiting. We have the Chop Chop. Hi, Bobby. Raise your paw. Raise your paw if you're sure. Hi. Hi. Oh, pause. Thank you. Say hi, everybody. Say hi, everybody. Yeah. This is Chopper. Yeah, she's a good boy. You got a gray muzzle even though you're a puppy still. He's just a couple years old. He's about three. And then you guys all know... The, nope, you want to give me your paw too? You all know Nitro. Oh, you've been a bad boy lately. Oh, you've been a bad boy. Look at that face. You've been a bad boy. Give me a paw. Oh, you, I'm, I'm making too much noise. And I, the other two, the, there was two kitties. There was Gizzy. And I don't know where they went. They were sitting in the sunshine. You guys want to go outside? Go on. Got to spray it out here. Be a little party out here, a little smut, tiny get together. Uh oh, I gotta watch him. He'll bite that bee. Both of them will bite those bees. Those like carpenter bees. We um, we got lights up around out here now, and cushions are falling down. I'm gonna get new cushions out here. We're gonna make it a little, little nice. We're gonna make it nice out here. We had a little, little fire the other night for Drew's birthday. Okay, my Grove Collaborative came in. Look, they always put. I wanna be careful. Thank you, Terry. 
Um, I could not find toilet paper. We've been struggling, so this is the one place I could find it. So I'll figure I'll show you what I got. Um, they always give you all kinds of free gifts and stuff too. But if you're struggling to find toilet paper, check out Grove Collaborative. I'll put my link. You'll also get a free five-piece set if you... I think you have to spend like... I don't remember, but you spend like a certain amount and you get... I think you spend have to spend 15... I don't even remember. 25 bucks and you get a beautiful fifteen um, five-piece set. So I got this. This is a sink strainer with a pop-out stopper. Because somebody, no matter how many times I tell them, Robert, keeps putting the dirty dishes in the wrong side and then I have to scoop out and it gets all deep in there all of the junk so that's what this is for that's because he can't follow directions um, I also like these walnut cellulose scrubber sponges we use them a lot and so um, I got this is a two pack so I got those we needed some more hand towels and so I got these heirloom red hand towels and these may have been a free gift I'm not sure that I paid for these these might have been a gift like I said so there's time for me to go through this stuff um, stoneware tray cherry blossoms I don't think I was supposed to get two of these but it looks like I did so let's look at one of them see if I can get it out of here for you hold on let me pause Oh, these are beautiful. Now, I think the, they were meant to put your, like, your your soaps and stuff on. So, like, here's a, a room freshener. You can set that on there or your cleaners. Um, we have some that we use for this stuff. They Normally, they put... I'm surprised they didn't do it this time. Normally, when they pack these, they have blue masking tape over them so they don't spill. So, hopefully, nothing spilled out. Um, this scent is fresh cut grass, so I can't wait. But this is just dish soap, so you can put these on there. But these are so beautiful. I mean, I might use one for that purpose in the kitchen, and I might use the other one for my desk in here. Like, maybe I can put my um, some of my pens and pencils, or maybe like just a jewelry tray. I mean, I think you could use those for whatever. So we have two. I don't think I was supposed to get two, but we got two. Um, okay. So there, there was a little set that came together here. They had stuff in. So I think this is a little, um, just a little pail for you to put your cleaning supplies in. Yeah. It's just a little pink pail for your cleaning supplies. And I like to have one of these in every bathroom. Um, this one will probably go in the downstairs bathroom. Um, I think I have one in the other two. I gotta check and see which bathrooms do not have a pail. And then I'll put like essential cleaning supplies so that when I go, we have three bathrooms in the house, that way when I go to clean, everything I really need is right in here, so. All right, then. We have a cherry blossom dish towel. Cherry blossom was their new scent that they just rolled out. And so they sent, um, they had like a little package of everything that you could get um, together. And that came with it. That probably came with this. I know there was that. Um, this is rose scent room freshener. It might've been, I don't know what came in what now. This is also rose scent. This is probably one of their newer scents as well. I love, 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 love this multi-surface cleaner. I like literally love it. So you can put that in there to clean like your bathrooms and then spray it with rose, make everything beauteous. Um, and then this one is their rose scented dish soap. But I was pretty, this one, see this one opened. This is why they're packing these. This is one of the few places, I'm gonna have to wipe this down, that you can still get products delivered and they do, um, I'm going to have to let them know that they didn't they didn't put the tape over it and one of them leaked. But um, this is one of the few places you can still get stuff. So I'm going to actually stick that there and have you guys hold on a minute because somebody wants to come in. Look at him. <laughs> okay. And then you saw we got the fresh cut green grass as well. And the same, the same kind in dish soap. What else? I think I was supposed to get cherry blossom, but I got all the rose scents. So I have to double check that too, because I'm pretty sure I was supposed to get cherry blossom, not rose. And they sent me a whole set of, unless maybe they ran out, I don't know. Um, and there, here's another cherry blossom dish towel. So I'm gonna put those dish towels in their kitchen in just a second. Uh, something else is spilling down here. Okay, so we got 
a carpet and upholstery stain remover. This I ordered because of the dogs. They just make such a freaking mess. And now that I have like a lighter colored carpet, if we get little stains on it, I'll use this. This is non-toxic to animals. All of their stuff is chemical free. And this one, I know it's not focusing, is lavender and thyme. So that should be nice. And this is leaking. Oh, damn. This, I have never, ever had an issue with Grove Collaborative, ever. This is the first box I've had an issue with anything broken or leaking. So the stain remover free and clear is also leaking. I'm going to have to message them. Um, Robert really likes this. This is the apple cider vinegar, the um, Bragg stuff. He really, really likes this. This is his favorite kind. So kind of ordered this for him. I try to keep this, this stuff in stock for him. We have a couple of these now. All right, we have a soap down here. This is wildflower soap. Um, I just didn't, I stocked up because I didn't know like what was gonna, we were gonna have a hard time with, you know, and um, I don't see my toilet paper unless it's this stuff. Let's see. Ooh, this smells pretty, but look at how beautiful this wildflower soap is. It's beautiful. I really like this. I, they also really, they have like a lemon one and that's my favorite, but there's the little, the wildflower one. Super cute. And we have um, these go in your laundry, the, the laundry scent boosters. This looks like another fresh cut grass scent hand soap. We have a Iowa pine dish soap. I like the scent of pine too. And an Iowa pine multi-surface. What is this? This was a little free gift. Eucalyptus and spearmint, cool and soothing. Is a little candle maybe? Hold on. OMG, this smells so good. It smells just like spearmint. This is the perfect little travel candle, even though we can't travel. I'm gonna actually stick that on my desk. And as soon as I get started, and Gizzy's getting in trouble, she's gotta get down. I'm gonna actually light my little candle here. Do you hear her? That's what she does. She makes a trilling noise when she's aggravated with me and she wants me to leave her alone. Okay, what is this? This is bath tissue. Softer and thicker bath tissue. So that's probably what all of these are. And there's, yep. So if you need toilet paper, go to Grove Collaborative. Um, and here's their toilet paper. So I don't really care if it's soft or hard at this point. I got what I could get because they're, they were even running low. If you, to get your order shipped quicker, um, VIP members, it's $19.99 a year and then you get free shipping. And so what do I get? I got eight, 12, 12 things of toilet paper. So we'll be good for a little bit, but those are, um, not the best toilet paper in my opinion they're but they're like made of something weird they're tree free see they're not made from trees so i don't know what they're making that toilet paper out of but it works and it's fine um and it looks like i've got a little <laughs> gizzy i've got a little something that broke off here i don't know which this goes to so i'll have to find out so i've got a couple broken items i also don't have a packing slip that came in here so i'm going to check my order contact them and i'm sure they'll fix whatever the issues are but um I'm gonna let them know that two of the items were leaking. And um, we got a little bit of a mess in here, nothing crazy. And yeah, so that was my order from Grove Collaborative. Everything will be linked down below for you guys. Here are my two potted plants. The pots are mine. I got these pots, aren't they cute? They're plastic. Got those from Lowe's this morning. And then from the Knock Knock Company, Here's a better look at the flowers. It's like pansies and then the purple is kale. It's an ornamental kale. I'm hoping these fluff up and get a lot fuller and prettier as they're able to sit out here and enjoy. They've been watered. They were a little droopy from traveling, I guess. But I just have them both on the steps here. So that is what they looked turned out like. These little crap heads have interfered with my work day all day long. Scratching on my chair, arrow. Jumping on my keyboard, gizzy. Just being an asshole, Taz. Don't you hiss at me. And now they're tired of that and they're all sleeping. 
And here's this one hiding, who got into cookies while we were all sleeping last night and ate the cookies and left the paper all over the floor. Good morning, friends. It is Saturday. Um, I am gonna have some tea. I got my Sips V box and I'm just heating the water up. It's pretty hot already. Um, no makeup on yet, so you're gonna see I have some some boo-boos on my face. I had, I've been getting these, um, I don't know what they are, they're like hard balls underneath the skin. I don't know if they're calcium buildups or they're collagen buildups, I don't know. And my new skincare routine's been bringing them to the surface, but still getting them out has left like little marks. So if you guys have a cure for that, let me know. I'm actually gonna use, I got the Pat McGrath um, concealer, and when I do my makeup today, I'm gonna use that. I used it yesterday and it worked really well. Um, so let me just show you my Sipsby box. We'll see what's in here. Um, this is $15 a month. I do get the scent complimentary, and um, you get 15 teas in here, and I do have a code for you. I believe it's Terry5. That'll give you $5 off your first box. Uh, these are my April teas. It says April teas. And on the back it says made for Terry. You do take a tea profile and you fill out, you know, the kind of flavors you like, what you don't like, and um, then they curate a box for you and you can give feedback on your teas as well so they know to send you more of that kind or not to send you. Like I have a lot, of, I like black teas, so I typically get a lot of black teas. Uh, let's see what we got. Uh, we got orange passion fruit moringa energy infusion. That I think is this. Super caffeinated moringa infusion orange passion fruit. So I, I might have that today. This is a high caffeine. It's it, so it gives you levels of the caffeine, and this is super caffeinated. This is a moringa energy infusion contains 155 milligrams of organic caffeine tea extract, making it the perfect coffee replacement and providing an energy boost without jitters or crash. Okay, so I have a few of those. So I'm thinking I'm gonna do that today. I have my cup. I already put one of my Splenda in there. All right, so we have a few, so we have a few of those. And then we got, what is this? Little Bird and SJ Tucker Blend. Uh, this is low caffeine, and this is by Dry, Dryad Tea. And it says green tea, jasmine petals, heather, rose petals, papaya pieces, strawberry pieces, and natural flavors and on here it says if I am a little bird next time I open up my eyes I'm gonna have to learn how to spread my wings and fly and turn loose all of the things that try to keep me on the ground I got no time to be afraid so you're not gonna catch me looking down that's so cute all right so this is a low caffeine so this is gonna be a good one for evening time and it seems like it's sort of a florally like fruit type of a tea then, oh, I love these. Okay, so we got more tea drops. There's a few of these in here. These ones are matcha green tea. Sorry, my, I know my skin is like, I got serums and stuff on my face so my skin's shining. Um, these are medium caffeine, and these are a full-bodied matcha green tea to kickstart your morning, help you power through your afternoon with calm alertness. You're just a drop away from your perfect cuppa. Now, these are usually in the shape of like a flower or a heart, and you just literally drop them in the hot water and they dissolve completely. And then you can add in, if you use milk or you use tea, um, a little sugar or whatever, you can add those in. So we got a few of those. Um, I'm assuming that this is for our loose tea. These are little tea bags. I actually have some of them right here. They send you plenty. So if you have any loose tea inside here, they have little like organza or I don't know, what kind of cloth, muslin cloth tea bags to put your loose tea in. Those are fabulous. So they sent some more of that. And then this is French lavender buku tea. Um, black tea, lemon myrtle, cocoa shells, buco leaves, lavender flowers, and rose petals. And then there's a coupon you can see right on it, 25% off. This is a medium caffeine as well, and it says this black tea blend features a restorative calming properties, probably because of the lavender, with a unique herbal taste. Buca is an aromatic plant from South Africa with a flavor similar to black currant. I've never tried buca. Have you tried buca? No, buca. Buca, buca, buca. All right. So we're not going to try that today, um, but we are going to have the orange passion tea. Put my little tea back in here. So this, I'm going to try this with you guys today. This will be our morning tea, orange passion fruit, and super caffeinated. We'll see if I get jitters. <laughs> I'll let you know. Um, and this is like loose tea in a little organza bag. Put that, drop that in. 
Oops, I knew that was gonna happen. That's been waiting to happen for a while. All right, so. I'm gonna pick that up. Okay, I'll give this a little stir stir. It's probably too hot for me to get into right at the moment. Um, I don't mind the mess in that back room. That is all stuff that is leaving this house shortly. We've been doing some cleaning and organizing. Also, I showed you my Grove Collaborative stuff and today I had to clean this counter off here and I used this Fresh Cut Grass by Mrs. Meyers Multi-Surface Spray and it does smell just like fresh cut grass. It was like, it was such a fresh scent to bring in the house. Really, really like it. I'm gonna use it on my kitchen table today and the countertops as well when I do my cleaning. Um, I'm actually getting ready to do a foundation review for you guys um, with some Zueva, which I think is a German brand um, foundation that it's a little dark for my skin, the shade that I picked, and I'm not sure how I feel. I've worn it a couple of times, so we're gonna test it out today. And I'm going to spritz my face with this Magic Moisture Mist. This came in one of our boxes. And it's like $100, like $95 for this mist. So I'm trying to use it. Because what a waste if you don't use the $95 mist that you received. <laughs> so it's like a refreshing mist. And it's got really good antioxidants and good um, hydration and things for your skin. Um, today, I am, so I'm going to do that video. And I'm either thinking of doing a Pat McGrath eye look or I have a Natasha Denona um, retro palette that came in. I'm not sure which one I'm going to play with today. I, I might do the Natasha Denona. I have my earrings on from Park Lane from February Sparkle Box, these beautiful heart ones. And then my necklace is just a gray leather cord with this kind of hammered hoops on it because I'm wearing, um, let me see if I can show you. I'm wearing um, these little pants here and they're gray and this cord's gray. So my little gray camo ripped pants. So I'm just kind of chilling today. So, all right guys, so let's try, let's see if we can sip this tea. I can see it's definitely steeped, but it looks so hot. I don't know if I can sip it yet. It smells like oranges. What was it, passion, passion fruit? Orange passion fruit, okay, so that's why. It says you should steep it for four to five minutes and it's only been steeping like a minute or two. Oh, that's such a sweet, pretty, that's like a really nice flavor. It is a little too hot still, but it's very orange scent flavored, um, not scented. It's orange scented too, but it, it's very fruity. It's a very fruity tea. This would probably be fantastic as a supercharged caffeinated iced tea. Oh, yes. Yes, that's so good. Okay, I'm going to sit down and enjoy this cup of tea for a little bit. I think I'm going to catch up on some YouTube, go answer, um, reply to some of your comments. Thank you guys too for all the love and support and all of the comments and the encouragement for me to keep going. I did have a mini panic attack the other day. Um, I just, I just, I was watching the news and I went to sleep right before, right after watching the news and I had to take two Xanax to go to sleep. I just started panicking. I just, and I couldn't stop. Um, so I just, I need to settle back and not watch the news as much. Um, we know what's going on and it sucks, but uh, we just can't watch the news that much. So I do wanna show you, if I have it, my face mask, hold on. Our Robert's daughter got married and we had a very small private celebration and the mother of the groom made the little face masks for everybody. Um, and she did such a beautiful job. If you're on my Facebook page, you'll see all the beautiful flowers and everything because I posted a couple of pictures of Lauren and her dad and um, she made everybody one of these, but the bride and groom had one that said Mr. and Mrs. And just because of weird, odd times, we all took a picture in front of the lake with our face masks on. <laughs> So, I mean, they were all different. They were all different, but the, the bride and grooms were both white and in black, it said Mr. and Mrs. on there. So, um, you know, not to poke fun of the coronavirus, but um, she's gonna look back at that as a memory that, you know, she lived through it and she did, they got through it and they, they got married and uh, it, it didn't stop that. It did stop the actual wedding, like the big wedding that we were supposed to have with her and we're gonna do that at a later date. So this was just like immediate mom and dad. So, all right guys, I'm going to jet and I'm going to sit down and enjoy this tea. I'll be back and visit you guys in a little bit and I think we're gonna check on our flowers um, that we planted yesterday and see how they're doing today as well. It's only gonna be about 65 today, but not bad. A little chilly right now. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. 
Good morning, friends. Happy Sunday. I hung this pretty wreath up for the spring yesterday, and I'm just going to water my plants that we put up here, uh, put out the other day. They're doing okay. It's cold out. It's about 48, but it's going to be up to 70 today. Um, it's going to be an absolutely gorgeous day. I'm just coming out early this morning. I'm going to show you the plants again. Let's check on them, see how they're doing. All right, they're they're doing pretty good, and then there's so there's that one, and then this one doesn't have as many buds, but we're gonna give it a little bit of water. What the frick is that? What the heck is that noise? Weird. Okay. All right. You're a jerk. It's Robert. Okay. Stop. Right there. <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. That was Robert. He um so I, he bought me the ring so that we can see if there's people on the porch or movement out front or whatever, and he was making noises scaring me. Um I got a influencer box in couple of days ago too where influenced her I don't know if you guys there it is that's how you spell it right there um, I, I think I have a link for you guys if you want to join it but it's a community where you try out products and you, you review products so like if I tried out I don't know these you search for the product and you can leave what you thought think about the product you can leave pictures like i do a lot of like the makeup and skincare um this one however is for my animals um this is a influencer box for the dogs and they i don't know what's in here we're gonna open it together and take a look at it and then i'm i have to let the dogs try the treats and then give a review on if my dogs enjoyed them if they liked them what my thoughts were blah 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 and um, so I didn't pay for this box this is my second influencer box the first one I got was like a really nice skincare set from a brand that I it was like clean beauty brand that I hadn't heard of so um, we're gonna take a look in this box together and see what we get in here um, I just got up maybe an hour ago I haven't done my hair my makeup nothing so excuse the excuse the superstar look right here hold on all right so let's turn this around okay and let's see what's in here for the pups okay so old mother hubbard all natural in her bone influencer so it says no meat byproducts real fruit and veggies wholesome greens no artificial color flavors or preservatives and here's what I have to do. I have to log in and go to my old Mother Hubbard box box campaign. That's what this is called, a box box. Share the, this with my pet and tell what I thought and write a review on Influencer. Super, super simple. So they sent peanut butter and bacon flavored biscuits, a eight ounce thing. That's super nice. I think they sent me two bags. And then this one is a chicken and veggie flavored biscuit. Um, even though I have huge dogs, these are minis, so they're going to eat, you know, they, they're they not going to just have one because <laughs> one will be like, what the heck, mom? We'll give them a couple each. Um, I don't know if they're hard or I think they're kind of hard, um, like a biscuit, like a normal biscuit. So that is really cool. So that's what I got in here. We're going to try those out with the puppies a little bit later and see if they like them. I'm sure they will. I know that they love, they love peanut butter. We'll see if they like the chicken. Okay. The dogs are trying the peanut butter and bacon. We're going to give them each two. They're actually soft. I thought they were hard. They're not real. They're like a chewy, I guess is the best way to say it so okay all right puppy sit sit good good dog good dogs go get them <laughs> want another one no run away don't stop it Tut drew give me your paw give me your paw Mom, why are you recording the dog Sit, sit, sit. 
<laughs> You're such a grumpy. Give me your paw. Good boy. He's your cookie. Like that? Chopper, you want cookie? I don't know if Chopper likes it. Want another one? Come get it. Come get it. Get it. Good boy. Is that good? Nitro likes them. Sit. Sit. Good boy. Oh, cookie. That's a good boy. Is it good? He's not spitting it out. He's eating it. Okay. Sit. One. Give me your paw. Sit. Sit. You gotta sit. Come on. He doesn't like listen very well. Sit. Yeah. All right, come up here. You can come up and get it. Good. Well, I guess they like them. So why are you?